I'm Boyd Johnson with Boyd Cycling, and I'm here to talk to you about the preload on your rear hub. You may notice that the rear hub has a collar on it used for tightening down, and that after a few weeks of riding, you may have a little bit of side-to-side -side movement. This is due to the bearing settling in and road vibration. It's a very easy fix, and I'm here to walk you through on how to adjust the preload and make sure you get the maximum durability out of your hub. To do this, you'll only need two 5mm Allen wrenches and a 2.5mm Allen wrench. To adjust the preload, you simply need to put two 5mm Allen wrenches in the end caps. Loosen them, and the non-drive side end cap will remove from the hub shell. That will completely come out, and then you'll have access to the collar screw. Take your 2.5 millimeter Allen wrench, put it in the collar, and you want to loosen this until you can spin the collar on the axle. You want to turn the collar until it's hand tight, and then lock it into place using that 2.5 millimeter screw. When you have that locked down in place, you can put your end cap back in, tighten that, and then give it about an eighth of a turn and lock it in place. This is a system where your end cap locks into the collar versus pressing directly against the bearing. You reduce the side load pressure on your bearings, ensures the maximum durability of the hub, and the smoothest possible ride.